Firoz, uh, do you see uh, an impact coming uh, into the market once Jane Street is back uh, in trading? Uh, I, I personally think, of course, uh, volumes have come down. Uh, of course, I think Jane Street coming or not coming may not have too much of an impact, but it will have an impact on the skews of expiry day, uh, point one. Point two, I think the July 1st circular, which is a very good circular, uh, will definitely have certain impacts. The July 1st circular, which is a first of its kind, which SEBI has uh, uh, put out, and that's most welcome being a derivative uh, uh, trader for the last 20 years, I would say we've moved from del notional values to delta values. So uh, coming back to your pointed question, whether Jane Street being allowed to trade, will it have a large impact on the volumes? The answer is no. Will it have expiry day skews if HFTs, high frequency traders, have certain strategies? Will it change the skew? Skew is nothing but the volatility at which out of the money options are priced. Uh, that is going to change uh, for sure if uh, large volumes HFTs are to be traded again. Third, I personally think that uh, Jane Street's uh, position on this would be saying that if I have a cash position and if I have a derivative position, if one of them makes a loss, the other makes a profit, that's called a hedge. Right. So what's illegal in that is what I think if they ever challenge, like Sandeep Bhai said, uh, that will be the grounds on which I would preempt a tra derivative trader will challenge saying that market that's one. And the one thing which I think SEBI has been warning, I think what is the key takeaway uh, for a market participant is SEBI has been warning that derivative people are losing money. There is a systemic reason why people are losing money. More people are losing money and lesser people are making more money. Uh, that is because most derivative traders don't understand Black Scholes pricing model. It is like chased, uh, dealing in a stock fundamentally and not knowing what is discounted cash flow, right? But what I have, I have met SEBI uh, uh, professionals in this context, and I would say they are the sharpest guys, uh, very, very contrary to my perception before I had stepped into SEBI's office. Very, very sharp. And I'm sure whatever they're doing is the most sensible because we have very little data of the case. They know my position before I do. Uh, that's how sharp they are. So I'm very, very happy. Uh, whatever steps they take are the ones which are in the right direction is what my confidence is after having some first-hand information of the professionals who are handling this.